Yo, what is up, G Crew? I'm Chris G, bringing you guys another video, and today I want to show you guys three tips that are going to help improve your church photography. So, without further ado, guys, let's get started. Okay guys, so before we get started, I want to show you guys five photos that are going to help improve your church photography. Um, starting with number one, which is going to be color, and then two is going to be people, and then three is going to be emotion. So these three components, guys, are going to help improve your church photography skills tremendously. So without further ado, let's get started with tip number one, which is going to be color. Color is very important simply because it gives the mood of the um, whatever is within the frame, right? So whenever you take a picture and you're trying to showcase whatever's going on, color is going to help out a lot. So if you notice in a bunch of travel videos, it's always like till and orange, right? But as far as church photos go, um, you know, you can mix it up a little bit. And for me personally, I still go with the orange and till look just because it's very attractive and it's very trendy right now. So try to hop on with the trend and um, you can get showcased more on social media. All right guys, so tip number two is gonna be people. I always tell my clients that uh, people wanna see people, right? So um, it's very intimidating whenever a client goes to a business and needs information or, or is interested, whether, um, I mean, versus a person going to a person, it's more evenly matched. So if you are gonna take photos at a church, guys, um, take pictures of people. Um, it's more engaging and it's more attractive and people like to see people. So that's gonna help your church photography tremendously. So last but not least guys, it's gonna be tip number three, which is emotion. So this kind of goes with the people, but of course you don't wanna just get them smiling at the camera, you know, like a classic point and shoot, smile at the camera kind of deal. Um, you wanna get some action shots of them showing emotion, whether they're they're playing the guitar, or they're playing the drums and they're really getting into it, or the pastor's preaching, or people are just fellowshipping and smiling at each other. Not so much at the camera, but some like off guard pictures in a sense. But of course you need to be careful that you don't get bad photos. But, um, but yeah, so here are gonna be, again, the five photos that are gonna help your church photography skills. Let me know down below in the comment section what you thought of this video, if it helped you. If you have more questions, please let me know. But without further ado, guys, have yourself a wonderful day or night whenever you're watching this. And don't forget to please comment, like, and subscribe. Peace.